Z-Wave water sensor, used to monitor water leakage and whether the device is moved. Alarm messages can be sent to the Z-Wave controller or triggered to control other devices such as lights or sirens. Battery-powered, low-power consumption. How to add it to a Z-Wave gateway? We are using the Fibro Home Center. Devices. Click to add device. Add. Click the button on the sensor three times consecutively. Added successfully. Back to devices. It consists of three sensors. Motion sensors to detect whether the device is moved. Temperature and water sensors. We've added a light. Now let's talk about how to set up the water sensor to trigger the light. Scenes. Add scene. Add magic scene. If, select and click on the water sensor. Next. Check tripped. Next. Select and click on the light. Next. Check turn on. Next. Type a name for the scene. When water is detected turn on the light or alarm. Save and done. We can add another scene that turns off the lights when there is no water. Done. Now we have two scenes. One with the light on when there's water, and one with the light off when there's no water. Let's test it. Yes, when there is no water, the light is off, and when water is detected, the light is turned on. Well, that's how to use the water sensor. Thank you for watching.